everybody, this is Carmen from Easy Language and welcome back to the fourth video of my introduction to Cantonese series. So in the previous three videos I have taught you how to read Yu Ping, uh, sorry the tones of Yu Ping, I've taught you how to read the initials and also the finals. So today what we are going to do is that we're going to apply those into practice by reading some Yu Ping. Here is a quick summary of the six tones of Yu Ping. Okay, so pause the video, refresh yourself of the tones and also what they are and how they are like. This diagram will be on every side to help you. Okay, so refer back to it anytime during the lessons. So let's practice. So here is a simple sentence that we'll be working with today. Okay, so don't worry about what it means at the moment because I will tell you, I will explain to you. So I'm going to say it. And then repeat after me if you can. So slowly. Nay ho. Ngo hai si ga lai. Ngo hai ying ga yan. Ho go hang ying sik dei. Pay attention to my mouth or to my lips, okay, to help you and articulate the sounds. So I'll say it again. Repeat after me if you can. Nei ho. Ngo hai si ga lai. Ngo hai yin go yan. Ho go hing ying sik dei. Right. Don't worry if you didn't quite catch that. We'll go through them slowly in a bit. So now I'm going to run through all the six tones with you one by one. So I'm going to drag out a random word as an example and then we're going to practice the tones. So first we've got the first tone. Okay, we've got C from C ga lai. Okay, so practice with me. C C Second tone. Again, this is the mid-rising. So locate your the middle of your vocal range rise up to the top of your vocal range. Ho Ho. This one's a neutral, relaxed sound. This is in the middle of your vocal range. Ga. Ga. Remember the K is non-audible. Okay, so you don't go gawk. You say ga. So it stops just, just by the top of your throat. And here we've got the fourth tone. So remember this one's a difficult one. You have to locate the bottom of your vocal range and then go down. Yan. Yan. Remember a J in the short is pronounced like a J and not J. Okay, so be careful. Next up, the fifth tone. So locate the bottom of your vocal range and rise to the, the third. Tone. So right to the middle of your vocal range. Ngo. Ngo. Finally, the sixth tone. Hai. Hai. Okay. Let's go through that again. Nei ho. Ngo hai si ga lai. Ngo hai yin go yan. Ho go hing ying sik dei. So I put the little translation up there. Okay, so nei ho means hello. Ngo is I. Hai means am. Si ga lai is actually loaned from the English name scarlet. So scarlet. Siga lai. Supposed to sound similar. And then we've got ngo hai again, which means I am. Ying go yan means a British person. Ying go means Britain or the UK. Yan means person. Ho means very. Okay, so ho has multiple meanings. In this sentence, it means very. Go heng, pleased. Ying sik 
to get to know. And then you, nay. Okay, let's try that slowly. Okay, so we're going to look at the tones in more detail. So pause, slow down the speed, or re rewind to repeat. Okay, so we've got nay, nay, hole, hole. No. No. Hi. Hi. See. See. Ga. Ga. Lai. Lai. Ngo. Ngo. Hai. Hai. Jing. Jing. Go. Go Yan Yan Ho Ho Go Go Hang Hang, ying, ying, sick, sick, nay, nay, lovely. Let's try that all again. Nay ho ngo hai si ga lai ngo hai ying go yan ho go hang ying sik nay now I'm going to say it first okay so you get an idea of what Cantonese should sound like naturally nay ho ngo hai si ga lai ngo hai ying go yan all right, so that's it for today's lesson. So it's a very short lesson. Rewind the video if you need to. Repeat the video if you need to. Okay, so just get lots of practice in and then you'll be good. All right, so once again, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, learn something new, please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!